Hi all, this is part 5 of Ghoul Ice Elementalist, we're here with Ultraviolet 4, we're beginning this one with 2 runes in hand, we did 2 lair branches in the one episode last episode, which is pretty fast, and the reason for that is that Ured is carrying us pretty hard, we've got a couple of, we can't see the full army here, let's, let's bring them all out into the open. So we've got a bunch of ghoul friends, we've got a vampire, a profane servitor, a spectral Azrael, and a couple of bone dragons. Pretty good. Let's check our skills, no epic bugs this time. The plan is to train invocations up to about 20 or so, and then I don't know what we'll do after then. If we ever find a shield we'll train that, maybe we'll start training summonings. I think that's probably going to be our end game plan. Kind of like our backup for Zot just in case our army dies to orbs of fire. We've got um, the Book of Dreams which lets us cast shadow creatures. Uh, which we can't afford for a while but in any case I'm sure by the end of the game we can save 1200 gold. Alright, it's into vaults I guess. Could also do elf but I feel like Vaults is less dangerous for this character because it's more likely to have big open floors. Um, for someone like you, Red, you want big open floors because it, it allows all your team to surround enemies. We've got pretty good MR, very good MR in fact, so we're probably not going to get marked much. And good resistances. We've got everything, I think. We don't have C invis, that's the only thing we're missing in terms of. I mean, it's not really a resistance, but in any case, all our, all our followers see invis anyway. It's not really an issue. Alright, into vaults. Here we go. A nice big open floor. Perfect. Can bring everyone in. Alright. Oh, there's a shapeshifter. Okay. You can't. Wait, you can animate dead them. No, you can't. You can simulacra them, I think. It's one or the other. I don't know, it's odd. Anyway, I've started eating them. Ooh. You don't want our profane to die to a tannic, titanic slime. That's one way for it to die. Alright. Yeah, I started chopping stuff, but I should be, because this is the start of the floor, I should be starting to build an army. Go, Azrael. What am I doing? Oh, I don't have number lock on. Okay, now I understand. <laughs> I was trying to move with my number pad, but it was just casting macros. Now I get it. So when Azrael just attacks normally, because he's a spectral form, he drains things. Alright. The Deep Troll Earth Mages. They're not the ones that are really good, it's the shamans. And also, um, they're not good because they can use LRD on your bone dragons. <laughs> uh, so yeah, you gotta watch out for them. But in any case, while we've got Azrael alive, uh, we're not going to be getting a new spectral one, I think. Oh, there's something invis here. Unless we see someone like Saint Roker, who's extremely good. I think Azrael's served very well. He's throwing stones. Alright. Also, I really like when Azrael's got uh, a ranged sticky flame. So just sticky flame stuff, it's pretty cool. This guy is trapped. Can he lock the doors from in there? Yeah, I'm glad he can't. Oh, that sounds like it would be super annoying and busted. I should be doing all grabs, yeah. I'm being kind of useless. How did you get hasted? I hope that you quaff something rather than one of my followers hasting you. I don't think any of our followers can haste. Good. 
It's gonna call everyone in. I don't want them fighting out there while we're resting. Also, this is kind of annoying because I can't auto explore here. There's a strange disturbance. Oh no. These are stones, we can't even blow them up. Oh well. Okay, we're manually traveling through. And also, notice how our followers are no longer with us. It's because they're all standing in here trying to attack the monsters they can't reach. Good old monster AI. <laughs> Let's bring them to us. We don't want any amulets, not regular ones anyway. Let's just sort of swing a bit with our, <laughs> our mace. Got to be careful not to step through doors like this into rooms that we don't know. Because if there are vault wardens, we can get pulled in. It's not the end of the world, because we can always then recall the monsters into the room with us, but still. Nope, what am I doing? Ooh, we might want this. Okay, we got an acid dragon scales, let's see. Um, this is a relatively light armor. Our current is, what is our current? It's got RF and our corrosion on it. That's actually our only form of RF. Okay, so I don't think we're going to want it. But just to see, we've got 22 AC, 20 evasion. 20 and 21. And this can be enchanted up to plus 7. So it's a pretty good... It looks pretty baller as well. <laughs> that yellow. It looks sick, actually. Um, but I think we want to have RF. So unless we get some other RF form, I don't think we're doing that. But it's a possibility for later in the game, especially if we find a whole bunch of different um, enchant armor scrolls. Recharging, emulation, nothing there we're in hurry to get. We've got four fogs, so that's not a big deal. Why are we carrying around a book of beasts? We may as well just learn the things in here. Summon butterflies is really good as utility. And let's learn some Mana Viper. Yep. We'll put that on. I don't know. I'm going to say we're never ever going to throw an icicle. So let's just put Mana Viper on that key. And in fact, we're hanging around Amnesia. No, we'll leave it. Who knows? We might want it. There might be some super niche situation where throw icicle becomes the best option nice sky weapon I'm not sure what that means is that monster just sitting there maybe one of the vampires paralyzed it I'm not sure also this is not good um, I'm gonna call everyone back to us it's just kind of a, a crappy room where there are all these monsters in here um, and if we have, our guys will be forced into this um, choke point. So I'm actually going to yell and then I'm going to summon everyone back. I'd rather fight things, everything fights out here. There we go, that's better. Oh, our vampire knight's fighting down there. Okay, he's alright. Good, we're winning. Um, things are fighting. Summon our team to us again. They're gonna help by surrounding all that stuff in there as well. Okay, we're good. Are we good? Yep, yeah, now we're good. There's a lot of slimes. Everyone back up. Uh, Azriel, no! Azrael, no! Retreat! Everyone retreat! That's a Titanic! Alright, now you can fight. That's a Titanic! Ah. <laughs> Azrael to the rescue with the sticky flame again. It's actually, you get so much value when you sticky flame the big ones. Because when they split into smaller versions, all the smaller ones are still sticky flamed. Just to check. Periodically, we should see that there's still not a shield anywhere. There is not. <laughs> it looked like they mutually killed each other, but it was actually the spectral, not spectral, skeletal warrior from behind. 
helping. On we go. Uh, we've got two of us, that's okay. I really wish they were attacking that guy though. We can sort of start off like this, just with a couple of friends. Whoa, okay, we don't want that room. Uh, uh, we can bring everyone back here. Okay, never mind. Everyone come back. And then we're going to say, oh, not recall. Uh, stop the recall. We're going to say, follow us again with TF. And then we're going to do a bit of yelling. We really don't want to see a whole bunch of whatever those guys are called, what are they called, boggets in the open, because they're going to summon like crazy. I heard some shouts, so they do, they did hear us, there we go, that's better. Get the boggets. Good. Notice that a few times as well, uh, we've been able to, here again, we've been able to sneak up on stuff. That's also part of the profane servitor. The aura that we're getting here, not only does it make you have a higher evasion, but it gives you a better stealth as well. Maybe stabber of you red. Is that legit? Probably. I mean it is because anything of you red is legit. Look, look at this. Let's do some let's actually do something. <laughs> But yeah, like that profane servitor is just 1v1ing that whole room worth of enemies. Um, that's not a good place. We're going to back up and recall everyone back out here. As long as we're fighting in the open or in places where we can surround enemies, like not the bone dragon right now in that doorway. Yeah, so I'm going to recall them again, because I don't want the Bone Dragon to die. Did he die? No, he's still in there. Uh, I think he's not getting out. There we go. Okay, well that recall worked. Alright, this is better now. Um, the problem is the Orange Brain is summoning all these things. Get the Orange Brain. Everyone, orange brain. There we go. We did lose both? Yeah, okay, we lost both our dragons. No, that's okay. Uh, we're going to get more. Invocations to 18. And we still got Azrael. He's like the ultimate survivor. It's pretty nuts. Yeah, so that was that was really not a good fight. I don't know, I tried to recall the bone dragons out of this room back into this open area here but it seemed like the first time or even second time uh, they didn't come out not a big deal, we'll be getting them back soon with our faith amulet alright, so again here so I'm backing everyone up they just not see us yeah, and then we'll get them to fight in the open It'll work a lot better. Do some ore grabs, make some zombies. <laughs> wow. We're near starving. We have nothing to eat. There's a fire dragon. Um. Oops, not that one. Okay, and he dropped his scales. So here's a question. There is a trove that wants a plus three fire dragon scales. Check this shop first. Nothing too exciting. We have a wand of acid, don't we? Yeah. Not used it for a while. Okay, so we could get... Also, we've got a scroll here. Random uselessness, great. Enchant armor scrolls. There are only two, so even if we bought those, we couldn't we couldn't make that a plus three to get in the trope. But here's the thing, maybe we want these fire dragon scales. <laughs> Alright, if we put these on, 
We go to 2218. Our spells become a lot harder to use, but that's okay. Um, I'm thinking more end game, not for right now. And we'd still have a point of RC. We lose our innate one, but as long as we're equipping this morning star, that also has a point of RC on it. So I don't know. I mean, we don't, we can't make the decision yet, but when we have the decision of potentially getting into the trove or keeping it for ourselves, I'm not sure what I want to do. I guess we're going to find more fire dragon scales. All right. Uh, this is really bad. So again, everyone retreat because I don't want you fighting in that choke point enemies coming from several sides so we recall back and then now this is a better fight server to no okay I guess this is a bit more complicated as in like might make you afraid of your red but it shouldn't uh, you don't have to do this even if all your dudes die they'll get replaced Good. Uh, let's eat one of these. Get rid of our hunger and raise some dead. Okay. I really like Ice Dragon Scales too, as an armor type. But then I think we'd be in trouble with RF. This guy has a large shield. <laughs> no regular shields in this game, but large shields apparently. Right. Let's see. There's no way we could use this right now. Yeah, it doesn't let us do anything. But again, this is maybe something we might build to. So. Even though I know I wanted to go to a shield, I wasn't training it because, I mean, maybe this is the first game ever that never spawns a shield. And so we're training all this shield skill, but we only have a buckler. Um, but now that we've found a large shield, that at least gives our skill point somewhere definite to go towards. So I don't mind turning shields on. Still, hopefully we'll find a regular shield in the meantime. But... Um, yeah, we won't be wasting it, or at least that's the, the hope here. Reach level 19, sweet. Did we lose Azrael? I haven't, I didn't see him here. Go freeze, freezing the Yaktor captain. We just 1v1'd the Yaktor captain with freeze. What an OP level 1 spell. Let's go again. He is calling and there's literally no room to put anyone. Sucks to be you. Freeze, go. Yeah, it works, okay. <laughs> that was that was getting a bit uh, closer than I would have liked, but we got there. The book. Damaging ignition. Okay, they're all conjuration spells and fire. We're not going to be doing those. Glaive of protection. Good old freeze. This is when I said we could do vaults because of all the open areas. Look at this. This is not open. This is the opposite of what I wanted. Hey, Phantasm Warrior. We're freezing a stone giant. Oh wait, we're not doing it on our own. Okay. All this time, I was thinking, wow, we're so good, but there's been a skeletal warrior standing behind us hitting with a glaive. <laughs> it's like when um, you're the older sibling, and you, your younger sibling wants to play the Super Nintendo, so you give them a controller and tell them they're playing, when really they're not. That's kind of what just happened there. The Skeletal Warrior was actually player one, and we were just 
role playing an NPC. Man, all these rooms. They're all so choke pointy. Our servitors corroded and still just winning. Your vampire says, be careful. Okay. On to Vaults 3. I feel like there was something I wanted to do. Drop the ice blast one. No, that wasn't it. It was something else. Oh yeah, is Azrael here? No, we finally lost Azrael. Okay. Sad day. No more Azrael. Man, I didn't even see him die. He was he was MVP. You need to give him an F to pay respects. Man, bummer. Alright, so we're gonna be on the lookout for new targets now. A wizard maybe? Um Is that worth just doing? Probably not. They're pretty fragile. But they can have decent sets, especially if you get this one. Oh, he's got Blink, I guess. No, this is the better one, because he's got Crystal Spear and Bolted Colt. This one's not bad either. Uh, Stone Arrow is pretty strong on monsters. Lightning Bolt's good. Banishing stuff's always funny when it happens. And then Invis makes him more survivable. But, no. Nah. New Phantasm Warrior. Where are our big ones, Yurad? Where are the new servitors? We want Team Servitor. Okay, let's stand behind our dudes. Tell them to attack. Good. And we get a Yaktor army. Bolts are flying in. Ooh. It's too late now. Uh, I need to think that immediately. But Deep Elf Annihilators are definitely, well there's a new one, nice two damage, are definitely good targets to enslave. Because of all their really high conjurations, uh, they just blow stuff up with Crystal Spear and Iron Shots. Oh hey, we got a second Profane. I missed it happen, sweet. Nice, that's good. So we, we had the triple Profane Servitor at one point. I think we're going to go for the triple... Uh, so we had the triple boner dragon. Now we're going to go for the triple profane. You read mixing it up a bit. Where are the corpses? Mm, I don't like this room either. Okay, well everyone just ran in. They just ran in. Save them. Uh, I step forward because our Profane's dying, um, and I don't want him to die. So we're just going to tank in the door here and cast Freeze a bit. <laughs> Where's our Skeletal Warrior? We need the Profane to swap with the Warrior. Okay, we're actually just dying. It's alright. Our Profane's healed now. So I feel like I'm confident that he will win. There we go. What was that? Torment. Okay. I'm on the lookout for enchant armor scrolls. Flayed ghost. Ooh, this is a room. Everyone back. Let's not run in. Let's actually fight in the open this time. And we will help with the grabs. Kind of. Good. There's the Ice Dragon Scales. I would love to wear that. It's one extra AC than Fire Dragon Scales is, but it's just we don't have the resistance luxury to use it. Can we stab with a Morning Star? Do we actually? The helpless Vault Sentinel fails to defend itself. Sweet. That Morning Star stab. Good morning. Oops. Gotta keep the profane um, in vision. Hey, there's a bone dragon. Alright, so we lost two of our bone dragons. 
on volts 1 and by the start or about halfway through volts 3 we're already back to having a full set of T1 followers again. I don't know why I'm even bothering to freeze the ice dragon. Oh. Probably be better off just tabbing with the morning star that we have no skill with. Kind of looks like we're doing stuff because everyone else <laughs> actually hits for damage. But yeah, if you don't pay proper attention, it looks like we actually do stuff. This is something that I always find funny. So when the wardens shut the door and lock it, your allies never think to open it again. It's funny because they're all just chilling here. Whereas if I open the door, in they come. It's bizarre. And it's not just because bone dragons can't open doors. The same thing happens with Vio. Here's Marjorie. Okay, she's, she's a good soul to um, enslave. She has bolt of fire and fireball. Um, our problem is that she's maybe just going to kill all our stuff. I'm going to retreat everyone. Got to be careful here because she does a lot of fire damage. And we have one point of RF, but that's still not an enormous amount. Alright, so we're more in the open. Now everyone go. I really, I want to try to get the enslaved soul on her first. So I'm going to say everyone attack this other one. Oh. No, I think she's too injured. Yeah, she's definitely too injured. Oh well. Our team's just too strong. Okay. Oh well. Marjorie would have been nice. Oh, there's a fire dragon scales. Uh, Cause she had another one, but hers was not enchanted either. No. Oh. Bad luck. There's a couple of demon tridents of flaming if we wanted to do that. Um, we kind of we need our morning star for the MR, I think. If we lost the two points off it, we'd only have two. Yeah, that's not good enough. But it wouldn't be a bad tactic to even without training have the demon trident because we have gauntlets of war with plus five slay, and it means we can just stand behind undead and tab stuff with reaching always strong mm. no I'm just gonna hang up hold off but even just enslaving stuff like frost giants when they have because of their conjurations uh, they're not bad enslave soul targets Man, everything just dies. I keep trying to think, oh, maybe I'll enslave that, and then by the time I get there, it's already dead. On to vaults 4. Flying through vaults again as well. Um, I'm going to tell everyone to wait. Okay, it's a safe landing, landing space. Alright. Again, not run in, so TR to retreat everyone back. And now TA to attack. Alright, there we go. I've never enslaved a warden. I don't know if you enslave them if they'd start locking doors. <laughs> I feel like uh, that'd be a really bad and annoying thing to have to deal with if your own vault warden kept locking you in. Um, I was going to say, I think I'll recall them in, but they're actually just winning. Good. Let's rest up. Rest up a bit more to let our, our dudes heal. Another crude morning star. I'm going to mark it, but I'm not looking to to buy that 
our resistances are already really good with what we have. Okay, new book. Book of Enchantments. It has deflect missiles in it and also silence. Let's see, deflect missiles, we'd have to train for that. Charms and air. Uh, ghouls are really not very good at air magic. And not great at charms either. Mm, I'm not going to bother. We can just use... Hey, another vampire knight. We can just use uh, meat shields as our quote-unquote deflect missiles. Mm, Anti-magic's really bad because it lowers our magic. And that's not good either. Okay. Quite a few disappointing shops in here. That's a storm dragon simulacrum. Look at our stealth. <laughs> you just got one shot by everyone. Alright, when you're starving, you should be eating stuff. In a TT to yell. No corpse, we'll just eat a raw jelly. Oh sweet, we got a rune large shield. That's a plus two large shield. That's an upgrade. Where is everyone? I'll recall them in. Ooh, okay, so we've got a deep troll pack. If there is a deep troll shaman, we'll be all over that. We are just eating. I mean, I guess that's a form of healing, so that's not ooh, too bad. Uh, let's back up, because the first thing we don't want standing on the door is for him to lock the door and pull us inside. So now we're off the door. We'll say everyone retreat back. He locked himself out. Okay. Great. All right, now that they're in, now, now you guys can fight. That's much better. I mean, we don't know. We don't know what's in here. It could be anything. So yeah, we don't want to start the fight being locked in the room, even if we can recall. Oh, where did these guys all come from? Hmm, this is not a good room either. So again, we're gonna yell and then. We call everyone back to us. How are we going? We're almost at 20 invocations. Ooh, okay. Let's enslave Soul, the Annihilator. Did we get him? His soul is ripe for the taking. I did, I made a little icon for it and I've submitted it. So it's just a question of if the devs are going to put it in. It's waiting for it. Okay, so we've got we've got our annihilator. So he can blow stuff up with his crystal spear and all that stuff. The only issue is that he also has blink. So it's hard to stop him from blinking away like a moron into danger. Like here. He can just blink down there. If this room had enemies in it, he, he might just die. So I'm not expecting him to live for very long. But in the meantime, he can... Man, what is there? Can we get our C invis stuff on, on him? What is happening? Got all these goober zombies who can't see invis just sort of blocking the way. We need our... Oh my god. Okay, everyone retreat because you were idiots. Okay, there we go. Now I can attack. Or TG will make them attack. Alright. That's better. Just needed the the bone dragon to get on top of them. Oh god, it's happening again. Alright. There's the fight. In a crappy hallway. I don't mind if the zombies are throwing away their lives, but I don't want the profane to die. Um, is he dying? 
Maybe. No, he's good. No, he died. Okay, tick down to the the sticky flame. That is so many lost souls. <laughs> Alright, let's check out a drain life. Go back to full. Each thing, each particular monster can only be, um, what do you even call that thing? Regenerated, maybe? Anyway, it only works on them once. Because they become a, it's not a spectral form, it's some other sort of form, whose name I can't remember. And then, when that form can't be redone, wow. Rocks hurt, apparently. Dude. Freeze is actually legit on the fire dragons. Alright, where is everyone? Let's call them in. <laughs> okay, so we're down to two, two tier 1 followers again. A profane and a burn dragon. Oh boy, we're doing it again. All these doorway choke points. Okay, we're just going to sit here and we're just going to all grabs everything. Mm, really don't like this. I feel like our profane is in a really bad position there. Mm. We could also just kill all of this stuff with... Yeah, okay, everything is dying. Let's drain life. Okay. Oh, our profane did go down. Alright. I knew that was a bad spot. I could have just retreated, but I didn't. And now I'm worried that our bone dragon is going to go down. So let's recall him back. Alright, that's better. We need to get in a better spot if we're going to fight that. Like in this room. Everyone get here. Let's fight here. Alright. Well, that was some bad play. I mean, it's not like we were in a particular hurry. I'm not really sure why I just stayed. Hey, a shield! <laughs> Sweet. What's our shield skill? It's at 8. I think this is probably going to be okay. Let's see our spells. Olgrabs goes to 17. I'm okay with that. If we miscast Olgrabs every now and then, it's not, it's not a crucial spell. And then, Steaming Trident, let's find out. It's anti-magic, can't use that. Book of Transfigurations. The only spell we can cast out of this is Irradiate. Where is everyone? Hey, okay, Invocations to 20. Let's turn that off. And we're going to focus shields for the moment. Um, dodging's 14.1. Maybe we'll take that to 15 and then stop for a bit. And then start focusing or training some summonings. Something's killing our bone dragon that we can't see. Hmm. Just run up and shut the door. Ow, it hurts. The large rocks hurt. Oh boy, our bone dragon just got destroyed by the war gargoyle. Oh man, so we have been not doing well in in vaults. We lost all our tier top dudes. It's still okay. We've got massive armies of still of dudes. Um, and we'll get them back. Well, that's our vaults for now. So we're going to head into elf now. And we definitely have not seen more enchant armor scrolls. No, we've got two. Alright. So into Elf. Let's try and get our, our team back. Oh, yes, the paralysis. Go. Yeah, I only... That was a quite a disastrous vaults. Also, this flayed ghost, please just move. 
These are our only permanent followers left. A vampire knight and a flayed ghost. I'm just going to eat the meat ration. Because I want to... Oh man, it's not a good place to fight either. Getting flashbacks. We're going to end up with no one in a sec. Never mind, we have a profane servitor. Okay, never mind. So strong. Let him go. Okay, we've got to be a bit wary of the annihilator. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> I was going to say, because he can just crystal spear our profane, but apparently not. Okay, good. Just keeping an eye on him. Once upon a time, you used to actually be able to help your undead because you had wands. So if you think before when our profane had the sticky flame on him and I was trying to say will he survive or not back in the time we had wands of healing you could actually just shoot your dudes to make sure they lived in a situation like that but no more oh more how many artifact weapons does this game want to make hey we got another bone dragon okay Insta army, freeze, and some stats. No. <laughs> just wanted to see if we could do it with the freeze. We did. Every now and then, I just want to prove our character's worth. Make sure that we still got the level one spell. What do we pick up? Not in channel. Okay. And I. Whoa, boy. Uh, welcome to the Elven Halls 2. Um, that's an axe of flaming. I really wouldn't mind if we could enslave soul the demonologist. They can summon greater demons and banish stuff, so they're strong abilities. These guys are also pretty good, the high priests, because they've got uh, they've got smites effectively, so they actually have smite, but then they have a smite targeted damnation and Malign offering is effectively smite, but also heals them. It drains life from an enemy and heal he blah, 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 heals nearby allies. Oh, I thought it only did itself, but it does several. So they're not bad to have either. They're kind of um, fragile. But if they're standing at the back smiting stuff, that's fine. So how are we going to do this? Maybe just start fighting? <sighs> okay, I changed my mind. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> that one turn we just got destroyed. Because <laughs> what's in here? We took a we took a Hellfire. And we took a... Um, what couldn't have been a Bolt of Draining. What was it? Hand Axe of Flaming hit us. I don't know. Well, whatever it was, it hurt. So what's still there? A whole bunch of elves. The High Priest. Alright, let's just go down. We can stair dance it up. No, we can't. If we want to stair dance it up, we probably need to tell our monsters to stay back. Otherwise, they're going to surround us like that. And we won't actually stair pull up enemies. So let's say TG to guard the area. And we'll dance them up. Okay, I'm going to go TS. Everyone stop. And then we're going to enslave soul this guy. Okay, and now they can attack. And they instantly one, one turn killed him. 
So good. Okay, so we've got a demon order just now. So we've got summon demon, summon greater demon, and banishment. And everyone follow. Sweet. Only the elf came. We can see his abilities. Or he might just die to this one deep elf mage. That could also just happen. <laughs> Alright, good one. Uh, well, this is great. We have a one of digging, so we can get around it. But that's that's a really good trap there. Scrolls of Torment are always really valuable because we're immune. There's another one. All these hallways blocked with traps. We eat a royal jelly because we're very hungry. That is a lek. Okay, well, that one's alright. As long as it's not distortion. Your team members can get banished as well. So you don't really want them fighting distortion either. Slicing and piercing. Call everyone in. Yeah, we're good. Oh, okay, they're actually coming. I thought they were trapped in that other room. Okay. Okay. This is the brimstone fiends from the um, the spectral dude are really good because we're immune to torment as are all our allies so they actually can torment all the living stuff and I think they will do it um, so long as he doesn't go down really poison your hell beast okay well he can summon things that don't have our poison, in which case um, our all grabs is not great. I want him to not go down. Alright, there we go, that's better. Now everyone come. Sweet. Devoured by a tear in reality. That's better. Everyone in. We got one to eat? Yep. Yeah. And again. Good. I always like it when your followers say stuff too, like be careful. Also, that's just not happening. You need to let the real fighters fight. I'm um, gonna recall everything to us because our bone dragon's kind of dying. All right, there we go. So we've got a a hell sentinel. We gotta watch because I don't know if he's going to respect our other followers. No, it looks like he is. Look at him go with the the hellfires. Sweet. The demon knowledge is already proving his worth. Here's our hall of blades. We're not going to be doing that. We're not after a weapon. Right, and that's it for Elf 2. Let's stick our head down to Elf 3. And magic map it. I like I like knowing. Okay, so I'm gonna X whoops. That one. Actually we should do it down here. I'm gonna X out the exit because the plan is gonna be to explore the outer areas of the floor first. And that's what we're gonna do in the next one. So join me then, we'll do Elf 3. We'll see if we can find some enchant armor scrolls to get into the treasure trove, and then we'll be going into depths. See you then.